Hey guys, it's Nick, and today I'm going to be reviewing Galaxy S8 cases right here. So I have a couple Galaxy S8 cases, and we're going to do a bonus. We're also going to we're also going to test out this AirPod case too that I got on eBay for like five dollars. So so this one right here was the most expensive one. Um, this is like this is tempered glass. Um, you can charge your phone wirelessly through the back still, because most cases, when you put on your phone, you can't charge your phone wirelessly, so yeah, that's pretty cool, so, so what are we gonna, how are we gonna do this without a Galaxy S8, well, alright, well I got a Galaxy S8 right here, guys, I got a D brand skin on it, you should go buy these, they're, um, they're really cool, it has a nice texture to them. You can find these on like eBay or Amazon. Just search up D-Brand and you'll find the skin. It's really cool. Well, okay, so right here, Galaxy S8. My personal Galaxy S8 right here too. So yeah, this is my personal Galaxy S8 right here. So we're just gonna, so we're gonna test out the cases. So first, we're gonna start out with this 99 cent um, flappy like white case. So we're just gonna slide the phone into it. Okay, just fit it in. So if you look at the camera lens, you could like see the blue. I'm not a big fan of that when when the case is white. So. So, the case overall feels pretty good in the hand. I mean, it looks really cool. I mean, I'm a big fan of this case. Not bad. Not bad. Buttons still get pretty good access to the buttons. Works pretty good, see? Okay. So, let's take off this case. Now we got this plastic blue case, not as bendy or flexible. It's made out of plastic. That was made out of like softer plastic. So let's check out this case, guys. So I place it in my phone. This case, I can tell. Wow, I like this because it's blue, and blue is my favorite color too. And this case also feels good in the hand. I like the texture of the case. I definitely like this better than the white one because if you look at the back of the camera lens, the blue for my skin um, blends in with the case. So I'm a big fan of this case. Definitely better than that white one. That white one was like super cheap and like crappy. Oh, it's not crappy, but it's good. So now, guys, we got this clear case brand new like plastic clear case so yeah got a smudge fingerprints on it a little bit there so let's just put it in let me just turn off this phone real quick okay I'm sliding it in so far seems pretty well made okay now I see it in, so this case definitely feels like more sturdy. This feels like it's going to protect my phone much better. I like this because you it's clear so you can still see my d brand skin through the back of it. You guys can see my reflection. So if you like look at the reflection, <laughs> that's pretty cool. Well, this is what the front looks like with the case on. I am a big, huge fan of this case. This is my favorite one overall so far. I love this one. Favorite part about it, it's clear. So let's just take this off real quick. So we got one last case. This one that has pure sapphire on the back. It is not brand new. So I just found this one like in my, like in a drawer. That's in my kitchen. This one's like really super like old. 
so let's just try putting it in see how it feels I'm just doing a review on these cases Wow this is the most protective case out of all of them I still hate that part I like this this is my second favorite case the clear one was my first favorite but I like that I give this one a uh, 7 out of 10 Oh, well, the 7 probably would be like a 0 if there wasn't like sapphire on the back so yeah the sap the um sapphire tempered glass is just it's just i love it the feeling of it so yeah this is what it looks like edges hang out protect your corners because can I show you guys something real quick? So, guys, if you look at this, like, so, so on my phone, like, up here in the corner, like, I, like, dropped it, and, like, I got, like, a little, it, like, I, like, I, I, like, broke the screen, like, I, like, I broke the LCD, like, underneath the screen whenever I dropped it. And I also have a crack up there. It's under the screen. So, I already cracked it under the screen because I didn't have a screen protector on it. So, yeah. And in last case, we got this iPhone case to review. Oh, I almost forgot about this. Guys, we also got... um. This case to review is so I got a whole kit. This is a GoPro case. So let me show you. I got a, here's a Hero 3 right here. A GoPro Hero 3. So we're going to try this after this AirPod case. So keep that aside. So, so what are we going to, how are we going to do this without AirPods? Well, you're lucky I have my personal AirPods right here. So yeah. Bought this case for like five dollars, so yeah, it fits in really well. Feels pretty well made, made out of rubber. Yeah, feels pretty well made. Definitely like that. There, there probably could be better. Oh frick, there probably could be better, but yeah. But now time for this GoPro case. So we are just gonna slide this GoPro into the case right here. Oh. It this is a waterproof case, so obviously you can't charge it. Like this is a waterproof case. So you can't really charge it through the case. So yeah. That's that's really annoying to me. So let's just snap this in. Ah oh, frick. Broke my finger. Okay, guys, it's in. I definitely like the feeling of this case. If I had, if I had it off this extending thing, and I had so, guys, can I show you something real quick? I gotta find it. You know what's that, guys? Okay, guys. Well, I got it right here. This is my GoPro little, like, like, my GoPro accessories are all in here. Like, this is literally insane, guys. Take a look at this. Oh, frick. I got so much stuff in here. I don't know why I got a hat. Well, here is it. All these GoPro accessories. I'll show you what some of them are for. Okay, let me just, so right here, this one can, this go, the GoPro can connect to this in the case. So yeah, and then like you can just hold it up, like pull the legs out, put them like wherever you want. And we got some like bike attachments, you can attach it to like a wall. We got some head cams, attachments, chests, a bunch of stuff like that, so I'm going to close this thing up. This was like $25 for all this stuff to come. So I'm just going to 
close this thing up before I do something stupid. Okay, well, that's all for today, guys. If you guys enjoyed today's video, don't forget to smash that like button. Smash that subscribe button. And don't, and don't forget to, and don't, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and you can't comment because YouTube turns my comments off. So, yeah, peace.